viewers this video presentation is the best pharma company ajanta pharma the stock which has given more than 70% return in one year not from the 52 weeks high prices just a year of year return 70% now let us see the following details about the company the first key data quarterly results with a graph in graphical mode and a five year performance valuations on the target price of the stock it is presented in easy method to have a good idea about the company in quickest way within 10 minutes you will have a complete idea about that company ajanta pharma so we request you to see the end of the video then only you will have a complete picture about the company now this company is incorporated in the year 1973 price latest price 1650 one year return 74% equity very small 17.54 crores face value of the company too please note this company's face value is 2 if uh, the face value was 10 the price would have been nearly 8 to 9000 8 to 9000 please see how good the company is and uh, eps the ttm eps is uh, 62 anyhow we may expect in this price the latest quarter eps is uh, nearly 20 so we may expect definitely the ttm eps for the financial year expected 20 21 would, would be in the range of 80 to 90 based on the latest quarter eps of 20 so already the share prices is traded in the p ratio of around 27 even if you project p ratio of 25 with the projected eps of 80 to 90 you may get a good return based on which we are recommending return of employed is 19 percent it is a bsa 200 sensex company now we may see the shareholding pattern the promoter holding is a 70.51 percent a healthy promoter holding fii holding 7.71 di holding zero mutual fund holding is a 9.93 public holding is 9.59 please see the combined like fii and dii holds nearly around 18 percent so the publicly traded stocks held by public is only less than 10 percent less than 10 percent if the company could be able to deliver a good results automatically the share prices will move vertically up it will give you a good return than bank the, not a good return more than double to triple return than banks deposits okay safest bet now and also this company is a debt free company good return on equity nearly 21 percent sales growth 22 percent during last year it is a very very essential factor the consistency of returns and the sales growth is very very essential and uh, before going for investment we should see how the sales has grown during last 10 years it is nearly 22 percent nearly 22 percent more than the sector growth the pharmaceutical sector growth okay and also the points to be noted is debt free company so there will be no interest burden in the cost of production in the cost of production which is an additional advantage to this company and also one more additional point is please note the companies has not fledged any their holdings so fledged free stocks okay interest free stocks high growth stocks uh, high fii and uh, mutual fund holding stock this all are very positive and the essential factors to trigger to buy then you may see the reserve how much the company is having in its balance sheet 2898 crores please note the company's equity is very small only uh, equity is 17.54 crores for which it is having reserve nearly 3000 crores nearly 
3000 crores debt is only 24 crores total assets 3671 remaining portion liabilities 733 crores is a current liability not a loan bad please note it is a rotation of current liability then we may see the profit loss q2 latest quarter financial year 2021 it is a trigger point to buy consolidated please see how the exports and domestic sales percentage mixing of percentage as well as the growth this uh, slide gives two type of data that a uh, sales mix export versus domestic please note export 70 percent export 70 percent domestic 31 percent nearly more than two, two third is from export that is gives a good additional point okay the latest quarter q2 fi 2020 the income from operation is 643 crores so, so, sorry the q2 fi 2020 the income from operation is 643 crores please note as against the q2 fi 2020 income of 716 crores nearly increased by 11 percent so top line growth is 11 percent and also please see here the sales growth in in the in terms of export please note here export sales increased nearly 12 percent that also gives a big positive points because the previous year year of year quarter it was 447 crores now it is the latest quarter it is 499 crores so increased by 12 percent but uh, domestic sales not so much because of uh, industry trend and the covid 19 problem okay but uh, exports the company has grown a yeah, very good fantastic growth that is gives also a yeah, trigger point to buy okay and then the epitda nearly increased by the epitda current the let year of year quarter 178 crores as against 274 crores increased by nearly 38 percent 38 percent profit before tax 161 crores as against now the uh, sorry the old year of year previous quarter is uh, 161 crores now it is 249 crores now it is 249 crores similarly profit after tax the year of year quarter is uh, for last year 116 crores now the latest quarter it is 170 crores so please see this company yeah, agenda pharma just uh, for investment purposes of certain factors have to be satisfied the top line growth the bottom line growth debt free company fledger holding details and uh, this all are and also the year of existence the company incorporated near 1973 nearly 50 years services 50 years existence this all are essential factors before we are going for for any to buy a stock to in any company that conditions all have been satisfied the only issue is the company is uh, traded in the range of nearly 52 weeks high prices so please wait and uh, buy on tip buy on tip now the results is uh, given in a graphical mode just for easy view the same results are given in the graphical mode please see this is the income the income in the latest quarter 716 crores previous quarter 643 okay increased by 11.65 percent similarly profit latest quarter 170 crores in simplified manner 116 crores a year of year quarter increased by 46.55 this is the key factor to trigger just please note the top line growth is only 11.35 but the bottom line growth is 46.55 definitely if the same growth is being maintained in the coming two to three years uh, we definitely the share prices will go vertically up okay and uh, similarly the eps please see here the latest quarter is a 19.5 year of year quarter 13.33 increased by 46 percent this uh, graph this video is uh, just uh, the results in graphical mode just for easy view this is the eps this uh, this is a uh, 46.29 eps increase 46.55 profit increase 11.35 top line growth 
प्लीज नोट टाप लाइन ग्रोथ लेवन पॉइंट थ्री फाइव ईपीएस ग्रोथ फोर्टी सिक्स पॉइंट टू नाइन ओके दिस इज द मेन की पॉइंट टू नोट देन this results is a press release already we have seen the q2 results now we may see the ofli results ofli results okay the revenue from operation at a rupees 1384 crores against 1255 crores up to 10% this is a half yearly results first half year is compared with the previous half year compared to h1 fi 2020 already the, this results we have seen we don't want to waste your uh, essential time now we will see this only the epitda at rupees 497 crores against rupees 346 crores up to 44% epitda a yeah, 36% increase okay similarly profit after tax 318 crores against 331 crores up to 38% so quarterly halfly all are good now the export sales we may see how the exports increase right? that also in a geographical areas please see geographically how the export sales increase right? this is the total sales please see q2 fy 2020 447 447 now the latest quarter q2 fy 21 this is 499 crores this break up how the exports geographically presentation asia 1% down africa nearly 36% increase please note this company market usa 39% this uh, two the wide market africa and usa this company's export sales increased uh, dramatically heavy okay but uh, africa institution sales down 28% even though the africa sales is uh, compensated by 36% and also 28% but us sales has given a uh, good positive for this company please note in this point this uh, last year quarter it it was 111 crores now it has been increased to 154 crores so us sales gives a boost for this ajanta pharma now the same results Uh, what we have seen already is uh, seen in graphical mode in graphical mode how the total sales increased right? how the this is a uh, india sales this is a uh, export sales this is a uh, total sales how okay and uh, similarly this is the break up of details of the company in ec method in graphical mode we may see easily and the graph and uh, quickly understand now this is additionally we have uploaded how the last results is uh, is our because this results is the comparison of 2020 results the whole year with the 2019 that is a one year comparison the year ended 2020 with the 2019 how the company's uh, performance okay please see here the profit the total income nearly the 2020 year ended 2 2588 crores as against 2055 crores as recorded in the year 2019 please see nearly a good increase similarly the profit before depreciation finance charge and tax expenses in the 2020 is 776 crores as against 588 crores please see a yeah, very good a yeah, fantastic result of growth year of year growth is good Half year results is growth, quarterly results is growth, sales USA export sales growth. Now, and also this information is how the capital expenditure is going on in future because that will increase the top line as well as the operating profit margin. If the company is going to expand, it will be able to increase its sales. Automatically, the next five years will be good for the Ajanta Pharma. This is a capital expenditure program. Just please see, the company places emphasis on building of infrastructures to be future ready and to keep tap with the growing needs. This is the main key point. Please note. this is the main key, key point to growing needs growing needs during the year the third base of the third base of koragogati uh, plant a new manufacturing facility in pitampur madhya pradesh and a new r&d building in uh, kandavel mumbai were completed and uh, full became fully operational the expansion of 
the facility at a that just has been commissioned and the same is expected to be over by december 20 this is the main point please note so these results will give you a big boost to both the top line as well as operating profit margin okay during the year an expenditure of 245 crores 245 crores was incurred in the capital as a capex fund okay automatically if the company is uh, having substantial own generation fund that, that is the main point own generation fund it is earning nearly 500 to 600 crores by annually if the company definitely going for expansion without need for uh, loan fund without loan for borrowing that will automatically give boost to both the top line as well as the bottom line that is the another key factors please note and then this is a last five year growth how the company's sales grown the total income grown total income epitda epitda now please compare this to five two years this has contributed a good increase because last three to four years the pharmaceutical sectors were not doing well now in the year 2020 due to outburst of covid 19 this sector gives a very good growth this this source the growth this same trend will go upward automatically share prices will also go up okay this is a free cash flow the company will generate the last five years okay this graph will give the total income always please compare the year of year these two point only because this is a worst base this company's worst base so don't compare this please compare this so you may expect a growth in that during next two to three years next two to three years will be good for pharmaceutical sector because because of only outburst of covid 19 covid 19 this is a business cycle now the in the year 2020 the pharmaceutical sector are on the recovery mode automatically it will go a boom mode and then the cyclic will turn so till the time you may invest and uh, we will recommend when to sell now this is the final slide and also you may have concentrate in this slide especially because the slide is about how the eps will grow how the, the this point is how the current 2021 projected eps 65 how the eps will grow this is the main point the eps 2020 would be 80 and the 2023 would be 90 because of capital expansion and a normal growth normal growth operation in addition to capital expenditure sales so automatically the eps will grow in moderate manner even though the latest quarter eps is increased by 46 percent we are not uh, focusing so much just moderately we are increasing 10 to 12 percent in eps in eps please note so in the year uh, in the year 20 sorry this figure is 2025 this figure is 2025 within five years 2021, 2022, 2023, 2024, 2025. This figure 2025. Automatically, our projected EPS would be doubled from the level of 65. 120 you may see automatically if EPS is doubled, automatically share prices also would be doubled. This is a basic fundamental concept basic fundamental concept always invest for growing concern growing stock so that condition the ajata pharma is satisfied okay so our projected sales price now the current price 1650 so uh, this will be the projected share price in the in the same line with eps same line with eps within five years definitely the share prices will go beyond 3000 beyond 3000 it is our expectation the only always we our request is please don't go for short term invest in share market don't invest all all your money in one share in one sector diversify minimum five sector minimum 10 companies that will always give you a good return not a good return triple than bank fd's return because bank FD's returns are now going on downward nearly now it is 55 to 6 percent so you may expect a compounded annual return of 12 percent that is our major strategy 
to upload videos based on our recommendations. Our, our focus is to suggest stocks which will give a compounded annual return of 12%. Okay? Now, conclusively, we strongly recommend to buy Ajanta Pharma on every corrections of, because now the share price is 1,650, including in your portfolio. Wait for major corrections. Definitely the market will, will give you a major downward a particular day. On that day, you go for Ajanta Pharma as a one of the your stock portfolio management out of 10 to 20 stocks and uh, invest not more than 5% of your uh, portfolio management. We, we, it will give a minimum of double return within five to six years and uh, gradually it will increase. Gradually in, it will increase. Focus by on tips. Thanking you for viewing this video. If you like this video, please subscribe, comment and uh, share with your friends.